What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Uh, I'm back on update day, ready for an upload. And I'm gonna be showing you guys the new Awakened Doe. Let me just say, this thing is gonna get nerfed. It is so incredibly OP. But without further ado, let's get straight into it. All right guys, so to get started, let's show off the Z move, the missile jab. So the missile jab essentially is the same thing as the original Unawakened Z, but there's so much more detail on it. You can tell that um you could tell that the devs really wanted to show off uh, their skills and they really wanted to impress us. But this is what it looks like when you hold the Z. It's really nice. It has the hockey on the end. And whenever you shoot it, it'll pop you back and it'll explode. Here's what the Z looks like when I shoot it at my opponent. It'll pop me back and it'll knock them back. All right, so the next move is called Pastry River. Pastry River is by far the absolute best move in the game right now in the entire game if you thought that the original sticky dough x was really good just wait till you see this so the pastry river actually has two unique attacks it has one attack that when you use it on the ground it'll spring up a spike and stun your opponents and it also has an attack when you're in the air it'll grapple your opponent and it'll put them in a small combo so i'll start out with the ground attack first right here It'll pop you up and it'll bring you back down and you're stunned for the entire period right there. As for the next move, Pastry River, uh, the little grapple when you're in the air, you can jump however you want. Now hold it. It looks like this when you hold it. I'll also show the Pastry River on the ground when you hold it. And you can grapple your opponent. And it'll put them in a little combo and shoot them in front of you. And also here's the pastry river uh, on the ground when you hold it. Alright guys, so for the third move, the piercing clothesline. This move is the most visually aesthetic. Basically what it is is just like the roller dough it'll roll you on the ground roll you in your spike uh spiky donut and when you run into your opponent or if you let go it'll swing them around uh with this kind of like a spiky sticky mochi and it'll slam them into the ground here's what it looks like absolutely insane all right so for the final move, the V move, the Do Fist Fusilade, full salad, it's basically um, the Mochi Barrage, the original, but wherever your cursor is, your mouse, it'll go towards that area. So it's not locked in one place. It also has less end lag, so you have more combo potential as well. Here's what it looks like. Just like that. Alright, so for the next move is actually not your Scorching Donut, but it's your M1, your left click. So it's super unique. When you left click once, it'll shoot out a fist, a dough fist, and you'll have this little uh, floating donut. And on your second uh, left click, it'll shoot out another donut, and they'll each individually punch. But on your third click together, They'll do like a double punch and punch together and then they'll disappear. So then you're going to have to start clicking. To be honest, when you hit your opponent with it, there's not really any combos you can use it for, but it's fun to use. So finally, we're going to show off the uh, very last move, which is actually the travel, the scorching donut. 
So what the scorching donut is, is essentially the old travel, but way better. So, as you can see, when I'm traveling, there are new spikes added, and it also has hockey. And when I turn and almost drift, you can see sparks coming from the roller donut spikes. And the new unique thing, one of the new unique things about this travel, is it can go on vertical surfaces. It'll climb, just like that. Now, the old travel did have a little glitch on slope surfaces, where you'd go up really fast. But sadly, I don't think that's the case with this new travel. But, another, well, probably the best thing about this new travel is it can go over water. The running is gonna be insane with this fruit. I just love the new travel. It's, it's amazing in my opinion. Okay guys, now to end it off, I'd like to show how it looks to get hit by each of the attacks. So my friend here will be demonstrating the uh, missile jab at first. Go ahead just like that you can't really tell um from my end when i did it but you actually kind of get like pulled with the uh burning mochi fist when you get hit all right so for the pastry river the this is what it looks like to get hit by the ground attack it'll pull you up and i'm stunned until that point where i started walking All right, and this is what it looks like for the midair attack for the pastry river, the grapple. Boom. The next attack is the piercing clothesline that I'm gonna get hit by. Definitely the uh, coolest attack to get hit by. Go ahead. On to the final attack, the M1s. Thanks so much guys for tuning in to this video. I'm sorry I haven't uploaded a lot. I've been super busy. I know I always say that, but besides that, putting all that to the side, I hope you guys enjoyed watching the video, and I really hope you guys keep enjoying Update 17.3. And, uh, yeah, uh, stay tuned for more content.